I'm June, and I'm a medical school admissions counselor at Ivy Wise. I've also worked at Stanford University School of Medicine as an MD admissions officer. Additionally, I've worked at UC Berkeley as a pre-med pre-health counselor, assisting undergraduate, graduate, and alumni populations at UC Berkeley in the pursuit of a career in medicine. My favorite part about working with students is when I see the light bulb go off in their head. As we all know, it's very competitive to uh, be successful in the application process to medical school. The top things that medical school admissions officers are looking for, obviously looking at your academic record, how well you did in um, your science courses, and of course the MCAT. So hopefully you don't present yourself as a one-dimensional applicant where you um, have very high academic record, 4.0, etc., and a very high MCAT uh, score. That really just demonstrates that you're a great student, but it hasn't demonstrated to an admissions person your passion for helping, wanting to help others. And so this is a helping career, and this is something that admissions officers are looking for in your experiences. So volunteer experiences, research experiences, work experiences, uh, these are very important to admissions folks. When admissions people are looking at leadership, we're not looking at title only. You don't have to feel like you need to be the president of your pre-medical club, but really look at the uh, characteristics of leadership how do you identify a problem, whether that's in the laboratory, on your campus, in your community? And what sort of initiative are you taking to come up with a solution to this problem that you see? Um, hopefully that in the end you leave your legacy. Uh, that's really hard to do. I don't want to make it sound really simple, but um, that's really impressive, I think, for a lot of uh, medical schools. I really enjoy um, helping students figure out um, what they want to do, uh, share some possible ideas and options uh, that they could pursue, and then uh, check in with them to ensure that they're able to uh, follow with the plans that they've set uh, for themselves.